uh, under practice interview prep kit sorting and this is sorting comparator so let's see what that looks like oh boy comparators are used to compare two objects in this challenge you'll create a comparator to uh, and use it to sort an array the player class is provided in the editor below it has two fields a name and a score Given an array of n player objects, write a comparator that sorts them in order to decrease in, in order uh, in order of decreasing score. If two or more players have the same score, sort the players alphabetically. To do this, you must create a checker class that implements the comparator interface. My goodness. Um, okay, then write it write an int compare method. So this is looks like they're doing a lot of like Java sort of stuff, um, which. Oh wait, is this? Oh boy, I can't do JavaScript for this. So I can use Python, which is like me. Okay, I guess. Okay, so we're doing Python. We're doing Python now. Fantastic. Uh, wait, I had to define a player class. I thought they. Okay, name and score. Okay. Um, self dot name equals name. Self dot score equals score. Um, rep. I don't know what prep, what is that keyword? I don't I don't know this stuff. Um, Python rep example. What is this? Rep uh, function returns the object representation. It could be any Python expressions. Okay. Um. So comparator and B. But why is this part of the player class? It shouldn't be part of the object. I'm a little uh, nervous about this one. Um, can I even what, what I even have is when I run the code I don't even, I don't even know like this part I really don't um, let's see let's see what I run I just run the code see what happens this is like a little out of my comf like I have familiarity I just don't know it expect the output looks like this so the rep is supposed to print the name and the score it looks like so I think this I can do I think I'm supposed to return the self dot name. I think I could do some like funky stuff here. Uh, how do I do this? Is it like this? No, this is something else. Um, crap. How do I do this? How do I work with the f strings? I forget. Is it single? No, it's double. Oh my goodness, f string python. Oh, God, come on. Yeah, okay, it's just the uh, bracket then. Okay, so it's working. Is it, this is what it's supposed to look like. It's elf self dot name and then self dot um, score. What are you looking for? What's this problem? Invalid syntax. Uh, what? In parentheses? I don't think so. Nope. Well, it looks like I'm not allowed to use f strings here. So let me just do a format. Yes. Okay. Self dot name. Self dot score. And you guys are just uh, blanks. So I think that will be my representation here. So my input is this. My expected output is this. My output was nothing. Uh, am I supposed to print? Okay. I don't need that. Okay. Man, ah, oh, this is just like an uphill battle right now. I'm trying to figure out what the heck is going on. Oh well, I'm getting an error in other places, so I think this is the issue. So uh, sorted. There's something here between this is none type and int. Comparator is the issue. Comparator is the issue. Okay. Um, that it's return a, I think. The idea. Just want to like return something. Nope. This is a player and int. So I need to return an integer. Oh, uh oh, returns negative one. Okay. Return if it's that zero. If they're equal and one. Okay, so I need to return a number. So our number is zero. Fine. I'll just. Uh, this is gonna take a while. All right, so I, so I represent it in the same order. That's fine. I don't think I need the print to be honest. So I'm gonna use just return. I think that's how. It, I think 
Yeah, I think that's how it's supposed to be. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Um, now I need to actually do the comparison. So the comparison is that A and B are person objects, right? We'll say if uh, A dot name equals B dot name equals uh, and I, th I feel like I need to use the word is actually. It's been a while since I've done Python, but like name is a name is B name and a score is B score uh, return. That's the only time you return zero. If a score is B score, the only time you get down here is when the names are not the same. Um, then return, uh, how do you ternary in Python? I think it's just like a, a name is better than B name. Oh, I see it's um, one if a name is greater than B name else negative one. Right. Okay. So if the a name is greater than the one, so yeah, th this is where I, I need to go back here. So if a is greater than return one, so there you go. So a is greater than b, then return one, else return negative one. And that last thing is, so the scores are the same. Then you go by the name, and this is the last situation. The only time you get down here is when you are, you have different scores. Um, in that case, you say. Well, one if a dot score is greater than b dot score, else negative one. I think that's how it works. So let's go with the run code. Okay. So it looks like I ordered them by score. My output was by score, but we're supposed to do it by um the opposite. <laughs> and what's this? I have a mistake here. Invalid syntax. Well, you didn't complain before. So it's supposed to be uh, negative one here because we're going backwards. So negative one, negative one, and this is just one, and this is just one. Wait, why do I do it that way? Why do I do it that way? Literally just like this, bam. I'm silly, all right, okay. So now it's in descending order. My output is, oh, hold on. So the 100, uh, oh, the naming, the naming is off. The um, Supposed to be a first, so the naming here is supposed to be like this. Okay. <laughs> I mean, what can you do? Okay. Well, oh, oh, oh. Uh, let's see if I can run some of this code to see if it works. Probably, probably does though. Yep. Yeah, okay. That was a little tricky. Um, otherwise, I think that was okay. Um, it was very tricky to trying to refamiliarize myself with Python. I've never used this like REPL re represent. I think it's called for representation. REPL REPL REPR REPR function something is an object representation. So I'm, I've never really used that. So uh, that was interesting to, to learn. Um, I am familiar with the idea of having a method, a comparator method. Um, I I guess it makes sense to have it on the object itself because that way you can do like person greater than another person. And be able to properly compare them, so that kind of makes sense. Um, I just feel it's weird to have a an a here, which actually, now that I think about it, this a represents self. This is another way of saying self, so it actually does make a lot of sense. <laughs> Anywho, hope that was helpful. Uh, I'll be going on to another problem, an easy one next, and I will see you on the next video.